your body, this piece of meat that carries your mind and your consciousness, it's a biological machine. It's a vehicle. And if you take care of it, you will be able to do amazing things until a very old age. So it's good to exercise and take care of your body. I'm going to take a walk up to the park and do some exercises and on the road or on the way or maybe there I want to see if I can make a meaningful human connection. Oh, close! So I asked this guy, can I, uh, can I talk to him? Does he want to answer one or two questions or just talk to me? The guy that's playing there in the background. But uh, yeah, he's just a bit too shy, but the, he's pretty good. He looks good. Anyway, maybe we get someone else. Let's see. this guy as well he's a soccer player but he said he'll talk to me but he's too busy now he's concentrating on the game and I don't think I'm gonna wait until it's over but uh, yeah, at least if you ask around every now and then you get somebody that just wants to chat with you it's cool so my perseverance paid off I've got somebody to speak to me <laughs> what's your name uh, I'm Chantal Delaport Chantal Delaport and tell me are you are you do you have someone that you know that plays Yes, Probably. my husband is the coach and um, basically most of the kids I know them since the age of nine years old basically and they've been playing together as a team for years and from what they were before they progressed so so well and they beat it's the first time that they've entered the Bale tournament and they actually made it through to the actual tournament they went through the playoff, the round robin and everything so we're very proud of them and we look forward to them actually competing in this tournament that's happening in April. So what is this tournament? I can title it in here what it is. It's Tell basically one of the biggest tournaments, the under 19 tournaments in Cape Town. In Africa. Where, in in Africa, Africa. Where kids actually get recognized for their talent in soccer. And they the scouts and everything that comes through and it's really, really just great being in the tournament for the kids because every child that plays soccer from the age of five looks forward to being in the Bale tournament. So that's going to open big time doors? Definitely, for them, for all of them. Uh, tell me, uh, uh, what is the name of this club? Um, the, the, club, club that, yes, the club that they're playing for is um, Queen's Park, but they, they are affiliated to Fleetwood Western Cape. And Fleetwood Western Cape is affiliated to Fleetwood UK. And where is uh, where is this Queen's Park? Where is it? Is it really? It's here. This is Queen's Park soccer field. Oh, I've been coming here for years. I never knew this is Queen's Park. I yeah. never read the sign. <laughs> so I always come and exercise here. So what is this about again? The vlogs. It's like I do little short stuff for YouTube channel, and it's just about making human connection, mm -hmm. speaking to random people, yeah. and just hearing what what it's about. It's not. It's just like what is your life about? What's happening here? Mm -hmm. And then that's it's a small shorts. Um, yeah, this is like one of those that yeah. you put on quickly, then I have longer vlogs and stuff. So tell me a bit about more. So your husband is actually the head coach. Yes. How did you guys get into this? 
Um, well, my husband used to play soccer all the years since he was, and he's actually done, he's at Western Province for five years in a row in high school. He's got South African colours and everything. So, and he was a Bail United, uh, a Bail tournament player, and he actually won player of the tournament the year that he played. So, for him, it's actually good that he gives back to the youngsters on what he knows, and he's very proud of the boys that he coaches. I see it. It takes it seriously, like very, pumped up here. Very, so, very what I'm going to do is I'm going to get the name now, write it down, I'll title it in here, and come and support these people. Mm -hmm. And the coach and his wife, they are doing good stuff, supporting the youth, staying busy positively. I'm assuming that's like giving them some. Yes, it gives them youth. a purpose in life, and it also keeps them away from all the wrongdoing and things like that. Yeah, all the temptation. Yes. I also try. I lock myself indoors so I don't get tempted. <laughs> but it's difficult. Okay, thanks. Good luck to you You're guys, welcome. man. Thank you I'm so gonna, much. I'm gonna title it all in here. <laughs> Thank you. Cheers guys, thanks for watching. <laughs> Bye. That's what I love about doing this. You never know what you're going to find. I didn't know anything about that soccer team and even that cup. And that's, that's cool. That's a little story. It's a little connection. It's a little, hey, this is going on in Cape Town and this stuff happens. And nobody, well, I wouldn't have known about it if I didn't just stop there and just said, hello, do you know what this is about? Please support this channel and if you like this stuff, and I'll take a lot more shorts like this, just about random stuff that happens around me. And please just subscribe, because that really helps. And like and share if you want to. Cool, see you on the next one.